see right up there of my bed. Got some brand new covers and you guys, those are actually homemade. I can't wait to see like how I'm actually, can't wait to get back to my vlogs, you guys. Like I haven't gotten back to my vlogs yet, but I will for Christmas. And I'll actually think about other videos. If you guys have any vlog ideas you want me to do, let me know in the comments down below. But today, you guys, we're gonna do my day nine of my Halloween makeup looks. So excited. So if you guys have any other Halloween looks or Thanksgiving looks for fall, let me know in the comments down below and also guys if you're brand new to my channel don't hit the subscribe button for you guys late and also don't ring that bell so that way you guys get notified every single time i post new videos every monday wednesday and friday do not want to miss new content every single three times a week you guys i'll have all notifications on and make sure you guys always have reminders on for my videos. That way you guys know when it goes up. Now we just get notified when it's like 30 minutes or an hour or something like that. But without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started. All right guys, you guys may know I always go through and use is my brow products. The first one I have is this e.l.f. Me and brow kit. I love this brow kit so much. Well, this is how far I am right now. Wait to actually kind of like go through this part, this part, this part, and other parts in my palettes that I need to like use up. The reason why you guys, I'm kind of like going through this palette because I've had this for like since I started my channel. Like when you go through your products and you're trying to like actually get rid of a lot of stuff. I'm really glad I'm going through this and you'll probably see this in my actual future empties, but I love this brow product. You'll see more of these in my box try videos. I'm really excited for you guys to see really, really soon. So stay tuned for that probably in the next few weeks. So make sure you guys have your minds on of all your notifications so that way you guys know when my videos goes up. And then the other thing, you guys, I'm so excited to go through this. The Revolution Color Stay Brow Fire Filter Brow Gel. I've been wanting to try out the brow gel wax, and there's a lot of other brow products that I have not tried out yet. If you guys see any of the products that I use up, it always be in my future empties and my term videos. So I can't wait one day to actually do the pre box because I really wanted to like do that. Like I want to like see all the products are there. I can't wait to add this to the empties and you'll probably see more of these in my video like next month or so. But this is definitely 100% tank purchase and I highly recommend this one. This is the 306 Clear and Transparent. So the other thing you guys I'm already going to use right now, the Tarte Thomas Smoothing primer. Love this primer so much. You guys have seen this so many times in my makeup tutorials. That was the last time I actually put in my empties because the reason why I had to like get rid of all of that Paris one because I was like going through it and I had to add it the last bit of it in this one. So I'm really glad I went through this and you'll probably see more of these in my next video, video like in the future. But whenever you guys don't see any of the products that I talked about on here, I always put all my old products that I want to use up and put in this bag. Anytime I got brand new makeup will stay in my collection. If I ever have any nail products, polish or something like that, that's actually done. It goes into my beauty empties and then I go, actually, I do rotate all my nail polishes in this bag too. So I love going through all my products, especially my brushes, more of them in my empties. I'm so excited.
this is how much right now I'm already used up. I am so excited, you guys. I love this primer anything, but I'm really glad I'm going through a lot of primers right now. Right now, you guys, like my skin is like definitely like some of my areas are like definitely like really dry. Glad I'm kind of like hydrating my skin because really need like if you guys have like dry combination type of skin like me and acne it's good to get a primer and your basha charm that has like all that hydration kind of thing I see a lot of new primers and old primers in my end video this one you'll probably see in my next end video really really soon in the near future and then also guys after the november you guys will see the last skis of December soon. I'm so excited. Also guys, if you guys want me to do a TJ Maxx haul, where I have all the beauty products, like hair care products, accessories, that kind of thing, let me know in the comments down below. Hit the thumbs up so I know you want to see that. And then next thing you guys, I can't wait to add this and empties. And you'll probably see more of these in my box turn video. The Rambo London State Mate Liquid Mousse Foundation 2-in-1 Classic Beige Lightweight and Shine and Control. Oh, you guys, I have like about a few, couple, like two or three or four uses left out of this. And you'll probably see this probably in the next future empties. guys so the other thing we're also gonna do off camera like I usually do it's my hurricane stay in line medical eyeliner called black magic so I'm gonna come do that off camera real quick and I'll be right back all right guys so my eyeliner is on the only thing I love about this eyeliner is that it's so creamy right on your waterline and these are these ones don't actually eyes like watery and like that. If you want to know, this is how far I am right now with my black eyeliner. All right guys, so the other thing I put on is my Kevin Kwan concealer. So the other thing I put on is my Hard Candy Cheer Irby Translucent Loose Powder. Alright guys, the other thing I put on is my Elf Mole Mary Mervin lip liner. And then the other thing I put on top of it, like so pretty, it's the 22 Poppy Pow Lipstick. And then of course on top of that, I'm use my CoverGirl Lip Gloss, Hazy Gloss 530 Firecracker. This one's gonna be out really, really soon. And I'm also going to put on my eyeshadow. This is the Duo Shadow Impact from Bailey Taylor. So I'm going to use 
this color right here means that my entire eyelid. I'm gonna use that in my upper crease. And then of course, I'm gonna use my Max Studio eyeshadow palette and this one's already completely broken. So I'm gonna use this brown color right here. I'm gonna use that in my lower crease. Another thing I put on is my Stella Bella Wasn't Spur Beauty Balm Extreme Mascara. I'm gonna use my Too Faced Mel Chocolate Slowly Longboard Mate Water. And the other thing you guys I'm gonna put on is my Laura L. Paris True Match Super Blendable Blush. This is the C34. Tender Rose. And then the other thing, the last thing I put on, is my Too Faced Ray of Light Highlighter. I am so excited for you guys to see my next end video in December, my home care. And then you will see my actual beauty in January, which I'm really excited about for next, this coming year. Last thing you guys put on is my Thin Beauty Rose Water Cell Spray. I just went in my last, my first Pixie Cell Spray. Now I'm already using my first Mevin Beauty. This is the one I got in my brush charm and I've never tried this before. So let's just try it out. Oh my gosh, you guys can, if you guys smell this, if you guys get this in your box charm, it smells so good. It's like a light, I love like this salt spray because it's like so like lightweight to have like a salt spray. This is exactly what I was talking about, like having it give like that, just like a quick spray kind of thing. Love having a salt spray that just makes it so good to actually just wear throughout the day. And if you guys want to get this, it says shake well before use after makeup and application. Eyes miss evenly eight to 10 inches away from the face. I love this sun spray and I'm so glad Boss Trimester sent this to me and I love it so much and I can't wait to continue using it. But also guys, once this last one I have runs out, put down the empties. I'll go to my Tarte Stay Spray Stone Spray. And anytime you guys get a bunch of different stone sprays, I always like to kind of put a few of them on my desk. So that way, whenever any of this makeup like runs out, I just like rotate them, put in the empties, and I just keep doing that until like all my stuff, all my old stuff runs out, and I go straight to new ones. But yeah, guys, this is like my beautiful, lightweight, beautiful type of Halloween look. Love how this turned out. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys absolutely think. I love how it turned out. If you guys have any other suggestions for like really fun makeup looks, 
please let me know in the comments down below and also guys make sure you hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're not done that already make sure you click that bell of all notifications on that way you guys get like personalized it means that you actually get every single notification when i have it premiered so make sure you guys always have your reminders on and make sure you guys like you know check the time so always have your reminders on if you guys missed it it's still on my channel and there's a lot of the videos you guys can watch and everything but i love you guys all so much and i'll see you guys in my next video bye